Testimony is now underway in the murder trial of David Swift, a man accused of killing his wife over a decade ago in Dyer County. Tuesday, prosecutors laid out their case against him in their opening statements. And WREG's Mike Suriani was in the courtroom as it all unfolded. And you're going to see that complete picture of exactly what happened to Karen Swift. Once you put all those pieces together, we're going to ask you to find David Swift guilty of first degree premeditated murder. David Swift sat mostly emotionless as District Attorney Danny Goodman described the marriage of Karen and David as one with issues in which both had affairs, were divorced at one time, reconciled, and moved from Arkansas to Dyersburg at the urging of David Swift, saying the defendant was controlling, jealous, even stalking Karen, and that Karen filed for divorce in 2011. That those divorce papers that he was handed and was served with were found in his trunk under a spare tire. Karen was reported missing October 30th after attending a Halloween party in Dyersburg. It was revealed she never intended to come back to her home that night, but had to because of an emergency with one of her children. The state claims David Swift acted quickly and violently while she slept. He gained control of her. He stripped her clothes, except for her panties and he dragged her to the garage. Once inside the garage, the defendant stomped Karen on her head with such violence that it caved her skull in. The state saying he dumped Karen's body in a remote area next to Bledsoe Cemetery, nearly three miles from their home, used bleach to clean the garage. He then put a screw in one of the tires on his wife's SUV, drove it a quarter mile from their home and abandoned it and crushed her cell phone. Swift's defense attorney says his client has cooperated and agreed to a search of the property. They even looked at the cleanup bottle out next to the pool. He had a bottle, bottle of bleach out there, and they checked it to see if there was anything on it. For your news leader in Dresden, Tennessee, I'm Mike Suriani, WREG News Channel 3.